Hey there, Skywatchers. Doppler 10 meteorologist Jeff Booth here. The moon has a date with the innermost planet in the solar system with Mercury. That will actually happen on Monday morning. The two will be in conjunction, but you have to wait until the evening to be able to find them. But you can see the uh, moon will be just above and left. It will be a young moon just above and left of Mercury. And then the Pleiades will be very close, the seven sisters. Also, if you are an early riser, you can catch four of the five naked eye planets. Saturn, Mars, Jupiter, and Venus are all visible in the east southeast to the southeast before sunrise. Uh, Venus will be the brightest of the four and it will also be closest to the horizon. And also if you are an early riser on Friday morning, the Ada Aquarid meteor shower is expected to peak. Now uh, this is going to be a shower that we see generally every year. Uh, it is actually caused by debris from Halley's Comet. You want to look in the east before dawn and on a good year you can see up to about 50 meteors an hour. Now we will have a brighter moon out there, but here's the thing though. Uh, that moon is going to be setting before the peak timing of this shower. So if you can get out early again, you want to look up in the east uh, and you might be able to catch anywhere of upwards of 50 meteors an hour as the Ada Aquarian meteor shower peaks on Friday morning. And as always to see this, you want to be far away from the city lights away from the glare. You won't be able to see a whole lot if you're in town, but if you are far away from the city, look up and if you see a shooting star on Friday morning, don't forget to make a wish. I'm Doppler 10 meteorologist Jeff Booth. Happy hunting.